The Ultraman Speedmaster. Called that because in 1971's Return of Ultraman TV series in Japan, an Omega Speedmaster with an orange chronograph hand was featured on the show. For those who don't know, Return of Ultraman was a show in a long line of Ultra series. That series is still running today. We've still got live action TV shows, a comic book series from Marvel, an animated TV show, and also movies. So it's a big franchise. Now, Return of Ultraman was one of the earlier Ultra series. As you can see in this scene, an Omega Speedmaster is shown with an orange chronograph hand. So this was dubbed the Ultraman Speedmaster. It's not to be confused with the latest Ultraman Speedmaster by Omega. Now, I like the Speedmaster Moon Swatch, and I knew they had the Mission to Jupiter model. On the Swatch website, it says the watch is a bronze-coloured collectible with orange Ultraman seconds hand. However, when I look at it, it just doesn't scream Ultraman at me. Aside from the colour of the chronograph hand, the watch doesn't resemble the Ultraman Speedmaster. So, after making a custom Alaska Project Moon Swatch out of replicas, I decided to make a custom Ultraman Speedmaster. This time, I bought a replica Mission to the Moon Watch, as that closely resembles the Ultraman Speedmaster. I also bought this orange second hand. So, after switching the white second hand from the Mission to the Moon Watch with the orange second hand, I got an Ultraman Speedmaster Moon Swatch.